everybody, welcome back. If you're new here, hi, I'm Mercury, and welcome to my channel. It's my daily vlog, so whatever I'm up to today is what you're gonna see here. Today, I am still on the Oasis of the Seas, and I wanted to talk a little bit about daily activities that are available on the boat. So every day, they leave you what's called a cruise compass, which is a, you know, front and back, like four pages, of different activities, um, dining opportunities, basically the ins and outs of everything going on on the ship. So this is the cruise compass. It gets delivered to your room every day at the evening turndown service. And they show you different things, like things that are trending today. They give you health information. They also tell you, like today we're gonna to be arriving at Port Canaveral, so it tells you what time we arrive and what the dress code for dinner is today, weather, and so on and so forth. Then inside, let me get this out of the shadow. Then inside, they sort of give you a highlight of different like shopping experiences that are going on and different promotions that they're having today. They also give you the highlights. So tonight, we're gonna go to the Aqua 80 show. They also have a vocalist tonight, some comedy. And then these are some other things that they're highlighting. So like a 70s disco inferno party. This side of the cruise compass just sort of gives you the hours and locations of all the different um, shops and restaurants on the ship. So you have all of the dining options here and it does indicate with this little dollar sign if they are an extra fee. If there's no dollar sign, it's included. And then these are some of the different um, services and shops. Then on the back, this is the important page. This tells you everything that's going on today. So, like the gangway opens at two o'clock, so if you want to get off the boat, that's important. You could, the hours of the carousel. There is a seminar on uh, the power of Picasso. So there is a lot of art on the ship. So they do have a, a Picasso seminar. There's a raffle. There are stretch classes. So this is awesome because this is the schedule for everything you could want to do today. So I'm at the Schooner Bar because we are about to do some napkin folding. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. I wonder what kind of napkin art we're gonna make. It's a big mystery. Soon to be revealed. Okay, so step one is acquiring napkins. You need two napkins per person. So one napkin, two. I got myself set up on this little table right here.
I think it was Han Solo, that would have been Harrison Ford. Question. Who is the only one that's a non-Jedi to use a lightsaber in the original trilogy? Again, it's Han Solo. I got 11 out of 20. Yeah, I'm just kidding. Okay, we got 19. Did you ever wonder where these carousel horses come from or how they're made? Well, this art display actually brings us through the steps of their creation. So here he's getting painted, whereas on this brick, the design is still drawn onto the block and it's still being carved. And then on this horse, the carving is just beginning, but the sketching has happened. And you can see the head is beginning to be carved. But all of the details are planned out.
obviously a lot to do and a lot of different variety too. So that we went to the schooner bar and we did some napkin folding. So now I can make a Christmas tree out of a napkin. Yay! Um, they also taught us how to do it like little pockets so the silverware goes in it um, and how to make a flower, like a rose. That was really cool. Then we went to Star Wars trivia. That was hard. I think I'm, I'm good at Star Wars, like I know my Star Wars, but that was a challenging trivia session. Let me tell you, that, that was something. Um, we also rode on the carousel, and that was a lot of fun. That carousel, the hours vary every day, but it's, it's open quite a lot. I never had to wait on a line for it. We've gone on it like three or four times. It's, it's really a nice ride. I like going on the, the ones where it's like two by two instead of three by three, because when we went on three by three, I kept kicking Roy. I didn't mean to, but yeah, they're, they're kind of close together. And then we also went to the Aqua 80 show. That show was absolutely amazing. It was like a cross between like Cirque du Soleil and like high dive acts. It was incredible on its own. And then to think that they're doing this on a moving ship. He's doing the slack line and high line on a moving ship with the, the rock of the boat and the wind that's being generated. Blows my mind. Absolutely amazing show. And then, of course, we had to find some time to relax in there. Just chill out on the decks. A lot of different seating options available. Sometimes we sat down here in Central Park, which is where I am right now. Sometimes we're up on the pool deck or the solarium lot of space on the boat and also because we're sailing at less than 50 percent capacity right now a lot of elbow room on this boat the ship can hold 5,500 some odd people and right now we sailed with 2,600 so we have a lot of space and then we capped out the night going to the silent party if you've never done a silent party before, they're a lot of fun. It's like going to a DJ set and they give you headphones. So when you walk in, it's totally quiet in there, but everyone has headphones on. There's two channels because there's two DJs. And if you, you could see what other people are listening to because it lights up. So there was like blue DJ and green DJ. So you could see which DJ everyone is listening to, and sometimes people like start singing along and get into the groove, and then you like switch to like, what are they listening to? It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. So we we capped out the night with the silent party. So that's an example of a bunch of stuff that you could do in a given day on a cruise ship by following some of the activities in the cruise compass and making sure to throw in some relaxed time in there as well. So with that, I am off, and I will see everybody tomorrow. And until then. Stay inspired by everyone. Take care.